a lot of teachers always message me and say to me, how can I teach my kids better? And I think at that point, that's when you're making the biggest mistake because you can't teach them anything. And your role is not actually to teach them. Kids don't need to be taught anything. If you disbelieve me, um, there's check out Sugat, Sugata Mitra, Mitra, his TED talk. It's hard for me to pronounce, but it's the hole in the wall. It's about kids can learn themselves. And basically, well, you can check out the TED talk and you can see. But kids don't need to be taught anything. If you think about it, as a young baby, when you, when you learn how to walk, what... Did they teach you? No one said to you, take one step, take two step, take one step, take... No, that's not how you learn to walk. You walked and then somebody was there to help pick you up whenever you fell over. The whole point of being a teacher is teaching people how to learn, to facilitate the task of learning. I mean, no disrespect to you, but if you're teaching someone one plus one equals two, that is cool, but one plus one does not equal two in the real world. And if you know what I mean, there is no one conclusive outcome for every scenario. There's no way that there's one answer for every situation you come across in life. So what you're supposed to teach people, you're supposed to help them learn how to be adaptable, how to become accustomed to the way the world lives. Like, what, 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 what are you trying to teach? There's a quote which is really applicable in, the, in this circumstance. It says, a mediocre teacher tells. A good teacher explains. A superior teacher demonstrates. And a great teacher inspires. So work on being inspiring. Don't work on inspiring people, you know? Education is not about filling one's it's not about filling one's head, it's about inspiring their mind.